welcome to my home if you're new here my name is Karen so I have been working on my to-do list and I'd like to be able to knock it out in the next hour we'll see how that works I want to change the sheets and get them washing and but first I want to empty my dishwasher tidy my kitchen and the reason I want to do that first is uh, a viewer of another channel was saying that they love to hear the sounds of the dishes it reminds them of their mother in the kitchen oh <gasps> so then I was like Robin when's your next call I because nobody's up it would be quiet and I could just let the sounds of the dishes be in the background so now I want to do that so I don't want to have the washing machine in the background <laughs> so I'll start the washer after that and then I have laundry to fold I also have done other rock painting and so I want to show you that and I have named my roses and two of my hyssops and I have collected on one video I was asking for names for the roses so I've collected the names and I'm using them for all of my plants as I slowly paint rocks um, it's just very relaxing honestly and what else did I miss oh I have one lettuce plant. I still have it planted. I'm hoping it's not dead. And then I have some marigolds I want to get planted. So if I could get that done in a good hour, I'm taking whatever of my daughters who are free and uh, want to go with uh, Creasy and I to go to a noodle restaurant. So I want to get all of this done before we leave. And we're flying her out tomorrow. She's moving to North Carolina. She's going to be living with a dear friend of ours, a friend of the family, person of faith. It's a great situation. She's renting a room. She'll be near my youngest son as well. And they're super close. They're only mm, 15 months apart in age. So that'll be great. Him and his wife are there. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get started on those dishes. And I hope, let me know if you enjoy hearing the sounds of the dishes.
I'm telling you, having a tidy kitchen cheers up the whole family. So, empty dishwasher, tidy kitchen is done. And I was using the green grass or whatever, Mrs. Myers on the countertops. Mm -mm -mm, love it. So now I'm gonna change the sheets. Super thankful for these. So I don't have to wait for them to come out of the laundry because I can promise you I would be too tired today to go ahead and uh, put new sheets on and make the bed. It's really not that big a deal. I don't know why I have this thing about making the bed. Do you have a chore that is just like, eh, I'm too exhausted, I'm not doing this, even though it's not that big a deal? Let me know in the comments, what is your chore that is just your Achilles heel? <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and get the uh, bed changed, get the laundry going, and I also uh, was just in there, I had to use the bathroom, and I realized I didn't even clean it up from when I got ready for the day, so I need to tidy that up. I'm also going to need to tidy up in here. I have clothes that are not put away. So it does seem that everywhere I go, there's just a little tidy that needs to happen. Hopefully I can do it quickly because I really do want to get outside and plant that lettuce and marigold. Yep. 
Luckily, I don't need to water today because it rained last night. It's going to rain again tonight. So God is helping me out with that. I'm very thankful. Hey, guys, you just came upstairs to eat, and now you came back to your apartment. <laughs> I'm coming down here because I realize I have spare queen sheets so that when I change the bed, I don't have to wait for it to come out of the laundry. They're in here. So I'm going to grab those out. I had bought them when I thought my son was coming from Illinois, and then his trip got canceled. So... The good thing is now I have a spare set of queen sheets. <laughs> By the way, I'm already a half hour in. It's 8.30. Hoping to have at least inside done by 9. But if not, you know, I'm just going to have to relax about it. It's okay. I can tell you, I'll take a nice size break when I'm done with these things on my to-do list. And if I need a break before then, I'm going to go ahead and take it. It's okay if not everything gets done or if I have to have it done a lot later in the day or it's okay if I have to ask for help. It's okay, you know? We don't have to be Wonder Woman all the time. Whoops. Oh dear. I'm taking off the cover. Oh, whoops, I wasn't done with this one, and I started this one. I was silly. I'm definitely not going for perfection today because I do have things I want to get to, as you know. So if I get involved in all of this, you know, I won't get it done. So that's going to have to wait. But this, this stuff I will put away. mess the kitchen up now. Yes, you can. By the way, I love getting little flowers from my own garden to put in my bathroom. I am going to just wait on the pillowcases. I like my pillowcases. And that won't be a big deal to just do the pillowcases. There's a song that is running through my head, so I am going to put it up. Um, maybe someone needs it today. It's that song. Gratefully and humbly, I give you everything. And all that I can say is thank you. Thank you. 
So yeah, you probably like to hear it better from the person who sings it. So I'm gonna put that up now while I do my bed. These don't fit. How's that possible? I bought Queen. Maybe I needed. <laughs> so bad. Huh, I think I have a gray fitted sheet in the basement. I'll go get it. That was the strangest thing. I got those sheets at Dollar General. I know I bought Queen, but then I'm putting the fitted sheet on it. Maybe it's because my mattress is so thick. <sighs> I'm out of breath, but um, it didn't fit. Like it really didn't fit. Tried it both ways, didn't fit. So then I thought, well, maybe I did buy the wrong thing. And if I did, the flat sheet's not gonna be great, but at least it'll be good, you know, for whenever we get a chance to switch out the sheets again. And I put the flat sheet on. Flat sheet's plenty big. So then I was like, okay, they are queen sheets. It's just the fitted sheet does not fit my bed. Isn't that just so weird? Okay, so I am going to get a drink for a minute, five minutes, ten minutes, and then I'm going to head outside and do my little gardening chore. So stick around with me, and if you're working alongside me, take a break if you need one, and then we'll head outside and have some real fun. I forgot the laundry, so I'm going to get this folded while I take my break, and then we'll go outside and the real fun will begin. Did you have SI boxes? I believe we can. Let's get a tattoo to that location.
have one pot for um, lettuce, one for marigolds. I got these at the Dollar General. I'm putting sticks and pine cones at the bottom to take up space, give it room for, you know, water. It also makes the pot lighter and easier for me to handle. It also saves on dirt, so I don't have to use as much soil. Um, and then if it breaks down, it becomes mulch. So I had gotten these pots at Dollar General, and right now they're buy one, get one half off. So the regular price was $4, so I got both of these for 6 that's a really, really good price. So, and of course, the sticks and pine cones are free. So if you don't have pine cones, you could always just put sticks in the bottom of yours. I definitely have seen videos of people doing that. But I have got pine cones galore. In fact, I want to bleach some and make some reeds. But I don't know if I'll be able to do that. I'm guessing I won't be able to do that before my trip because I leave tomorrow. So I don't know my video schedule. If I'd like to get one up tomorrow. And then definitely not Sunday or Monday. And if I do one Tuesday, it would be a get up, film, edit, upload kind of thing. So let me just tell you, I will do the best I can. All right, I think that's good. Maybe a few more in this one. And then we'll bring it over to the deck and get some dirt in there and some worm castings. I think I'm gonna dump this out. This is the rest of our potting soil. I don't know what this is. Oh, it feels like a piece of shell. Could be. I like to put seashells <laughs> in my gardens. Right. There's some trash. And then the worm castings. Apparently you can put too much worm castings in. Have you ever heard that? Let me know if you have. I thought I read that somewhere. So I'm just mixing it up, which is what my husband does. So he worked for a landscaper when he was in college, so he definitely knows more than I do. down here. Nice. Okay. I should name my channel the clumsy YouTuber. Clumsy homemaker? Clutzy happening? <laughs> The clumsy, fumsy channel. Funsy, clumsy, funsy. I hope I have enough dirt. Is that a rock? Nope. It will be a rock if it's left to itself.
this will just take off. I'm going to take off the pieces that are brown and wilty. This is butter crunch. And then these. These are going in between my tomato plants. Thank you. 
me on a treasure hunt I long for something new Have you heard the fairies when they sing and dance? Oh, I wish it was me Every night When I close my eyes I see